Hey, that's how you start a vlog. How are you doing? Good evening and welcome to another edition of Hot and Spicy. Right then, what are we using? Getting excited here. Most important thing, ice cold one. And they are Carly. Hot and Spicy Wings. These are Tesco's own. And I've added today some of this. It's good stuff. Levi Roots Reggae Reggae uh, Hot uh, Caribbean Sauce. Extra hot, sorry. X hot. And it is hot, this. I remember him going on Dragon's Den asking for money to invest. And look at him now. He's in every supermarket in this country. Done very well. Anyway, never mind that. Let's see why he's done very well. Well, I always eat this stuff. Mm. Blimey, that is hot. Mm. Not even going to ask you if you've eaten. If you're eating. Oh, hang on. I forgot one ingredient. Tesco's had it back in stock. Their um, garlic bread with sun dried, sun blushed tomato. Oh, it's fantastic. Mm. Lawns have been cut today and they've grown too. Bloody hell. The forecast rain, but uh, I had a few spots when I was working, but um, nothing near much. So that's the job done. Um, a strange thing happened today with uh, outside in the back. I feed, as many of you know, feed the birds. Um, I bought a big feed, a long one, double size. With the thought it would sort of <laughs> reduce the amount of times I fill it. But it doesn't. They still eat the same Bloody hell, they can eat. I don't mind though, at all. But it was off the. I've got it hanging on a branch like that, you see. It was off the branch and sticking in the ground like that. Stuck in the ground. I couldn't work it out. And I thought there's no. But the only thing that's happened um, that can happen for that to happen is a crow because it was nearly empty because it wouldn't budge a full one a crow has gone and sort of gone to peck in to get stuff out it's come off and then landed on the that's the only other way or it's human and it won't be that because nobody can get there so uh, yeah I think I've solved the, solved the puzzle so I hope you're having a good weekend and um, as you can see I'm having one <laughs> a deal I'm doing a greenhouse update tomorrow and uh, I got well everything's okay but uh, there is good news and there's, there's bad news in a way nothing too major don't worry um, I'll show you tomorrow tomorrow's dinner is a brined pork chop which I learnt off my bloody good mate there Graham and it is now brining do it overnight in salt with um, Pembrokeshire early potatoes beautiful Pembrokes, I love Pembrokes the first taste of them every year um, especially you can buy them fresh in the off a market or somewhere but you know I've got them from Tesco's Pembroke um, earlies there'll be a few roast potatoes there'll be peas, carrots, maybe broccoli um, and gravy mm. 
Yeah. Hmm. Lovely, isn't it? Oh no, you haven't got any. Sorry. I know most of you are scoffing away there. Oh, you've had a good feed. But he. That's cheating, that is. Yeah, you. Mmm. No, very good. I was looking, you can see below here. I've got boxes with their cameras and stuff in. Equipment. Bloody hell, I got good stuff. I'm going to have to sort some out, I think. eBay, I think. Yeah. And there again, if you get rid of something, you can guarantee not long after you wish you hadn't or you need it. So, uh, mm. any other news? Oh, I was in um, yesterday delivering to a house. And this thing moved on the footpath. What the hell was it? Nearly trod on it. It was a baby blue tit chick. Or a blue tit chick. And uh, only little tiny thing. And uh, oh, it must have come out the nest, doesn't it? But it's, it's flying. It's okay. I think the mother will go down to it. Well, hopefully. It wasn't there today. So I'm taking that as a good sign. And this, um, what was it on the news? This this MP killed, you know, murdered in York. They're going to have to start bringing back um, all these killings, and they're just getting away. I don't talk political on here, but I don't care with this. It's going ridiculous. We're too stupid. If people say, oh, I was feeling down, oh, I was mentally ill, oh, I was this and the other, and that's okay, they throw social services at them, social workers, they go to jail, they have a fantastic life, and they shrug their shoulders, they come out and say, hmm, it's all right, and there's no fear. So I think an eye for an eye, you take somebody's life, that's yours ended. You know, you've got no right. Or give the family, you know, kill somebody. Let her family kill him. Get some sort of payback, some release. Know. Terrible. No, Just don't feel sorry for whoever he is. Bloody. Nobody's mentally ill when they kill them. It's funny how they're, they're okay killing them. They know exactly what they're doing. But it's after. Oh, I didn't know. Oh, I went blank. Oh, rubbish. Evil, bloody. And we're stupid enough to let them get away with it. Anyway, get me going on that. Bloody hell, that sauce is hot. Woo, I love it. Levi Roots. They sell it in different versions. I think and the normal ones, guys. I don't, you know, I don't eat every sauce I've got. Isn't always hot, but I now and again I like a good, good kick to it. And uh, this is done to perfection. This. Mm. And as you know, we did another GMP this week, and there. Uh, Great success, which we weren't sure it would be. <laughs> Not knowing what we're doing. That's the first time that. From start, excuse me, from start to finish. And, uh, but I think what you see, it's not the content. I was thinking to myself after. Um, it's you know because when you look at it. Production value. 
it's not that it's, you know, it's rubbish and it? it's just two of us but that's the that's the key it's two of us walking around having a laugh just that and you know it makes it makes it it's like uh, what's the word it spreads it and you know so if um, hopefully anyway and uh, it's had a good response and yeah it's fantastic it is really enjoyed it because we always have a bit of fun that's what it's all about life isn't it bloody nasty negative can't do it you only, you only live one life on this earth yeah so spread love and happiness have a laugh what the hell but some can't Wow, bit too much on there. <laughs> the yell. That is hot. Very battery no. Oh, it's funny. This camera is 007 camera. That camera there is another camera, another Sony. It's the Paul H camera, and there. Uh, I get a lot of people asking what my setup is, what camera do you use, what do you... I have gone through it once quickly. Oh, I've just shown, I, no I didn't go through the setup, I've just shown the where I film the shaves. But I will do um, a specific, um, very quick, of what camera I use, how I set the shaving, filming up. I think, because I get a lot of people asking. Um, the Sony camera. It's a good camera on a tripod. F perfect. You start walking with it, messing about, moving. It's not as good. It's not as good as this one. Look at that. Clean bones, yeah. Alright. I know what I'm doing when it comes to cooking, hot and spicy. I don't think it's any of them. Take two. Bloody hell, where's Graham? Normally only goes wrong when we're together. <laughs> I don't even remember what I was saying. Oh, it's just talking crap, and don't worry about it. Mm. Oh, it's been humid, that's what I'm going to say. Humid. Mm. That's another thing. <clears throat> I was talking to a chap about tomatoes and oh, he said, "How's your tomatoes?" I said, "Doing all right, yeah." I said, "I go watch the snails." Some snails, he said. Snails don't like uh, tomato plants. I said, "Well, I got some in mind." He said, "You might have a rare breed, eh?" I said, "What you what you going on about?" Oh no, he said snails don't like um, tomato plants. Oh, but I've never heard of it. I don't know if he's clever and he's right. Or whether he's talking, you know, shite. But I wish they didn't like the bloody thing. Why don't they go and eat weeds? Isn't it? Why don't they eat weeds? Oh no, don't eat weeds. Eat flowers and bloody veg. Whatever you... <laughs> Yeah. I'd be really glad you tuned in tonight, are you? <coughs> yeah, go and have a bite. Go. <laughs> mm. Mm. I'm enjoying this garlic bread. A good addition. Do you know how many of it have we had? I can't speak tonight. I'm tired I am as well. When you think of it, a Saturday for me is a very busy day. I love it. Don't get me wrong, I love it. I wouldn't do it otherwise. But um, I get up half past four. I'm in work for about five. Then I finish work about 
Well, it depends how busy it is. I get going on a Saturday, so we finish half past well, one o'clock, half past one. And then I normally put diesel in the van, fill it up for next week, give it a wash. If the wash is clear, if nobody's parked on it, and then nip home then and uh, get everything ready for the shaving videos. Get all the setup, make sure the cameras are charged. Do all that and <clears throat> do a bit of the editing. Um, then film this. Oh, answering comments, and then film this, and then edit this. Put this up. I make sure it's all and it's now you know getting on. So. I suppose you're getting knackered, aren't you? Mm. The battery's not happy once it go. Okay. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you have had a good weekend. I'm having a good weekend. And thank you for joining me on the hot and spicy trail with uh, the addition of garlic bread with the, as you can see there, sun blushed tomatoes. And may I say, it is fantastic. Thank you, Tesco. Hashtag Spawn. Sponsored. So, um, well, I may as well leave you the way I came in, as it was. So, uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you tomorrow for the Greenhouse Update. Take care.